In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can build a fully automated swag store in about 15 to 20 minutes using Printful and Shopify. Once you've got this up and running, you will never have to fulfill an order manually again. And when the order comes in in Shopify, Printful will fulfill it for you. So loads of time saved. And once you're ready, let's dive in. Okay, first step to creating a fully automated online store is signing up for an account at printful.com. Once you've done that, let's go and sign in. In short, Printful allows you to create designs with your branding, take orders, and then in, they will fulfill the order for you and send it to your customers. Pretty simple. So what we're gonna do when you first sign in, we're gonna want to go and head to this products templates page. And what you see here, we've already created a bunch of products for our MakerPad store. We've got t-shirts, hoodies, caps, phone cases, and zip up hoodies. To create a new template, go to this new template button, pick a product, and once in, the, in that product, select which version of it. Let's pick this unisex premium t-shirt. Let's go ahead and select a couple of colors. Let's go for a couple of blacks, white, off-white, and heather blue. Then we want to add our logo. So choose a file and add our logo. Give it a quick resize. Let's put it off to the right. Press continue. Great. Save the product template. And now it gets added to our gallery of products. See, that was pretty quick. Next, what we're gonna to need to do is actually connect Printful to a shop. So for this, we're gonna use Shopify. Once you've created a Shopify account, go ahead and log in, and you'll arrive at this page here. What we need to do from here is go to our online store. And with the default theme called Debut, we're gonna to wanna to go ahead and customize this. If you're seeing this for the first time, you have a bunch of other columns here. We're going to want to remove everything apart from a collection. And we're going to call this all swag. So if you're seeing any other items in here, like text or images, delete these and just make sure you've got one collection list in here or a featured collection. And once you've saved, let's go back across into Printful. Next, go across to stores on the left-hand side. And with Printful, it automatically connects all your products to your Shopify store among other platforms. So what we can do here is go to choose platform on the left of the three choices. And in the top left-hand corner, select Shopify. Let's click add app. Next, press install app. Make sure you log in. Press connect store to whatever your email address is showing in this box. And once it loads, you should see the Printful, the My Printful dashboard sitting within your Shopify window here. So what you can see is you can see open the full site, which takes you to the full version of Printful, but we've got it open in our tab already. And then you can do all of the things you can do inside Printful, inside of Shopify. But what we want to do is actually bring across some products that we created from our templates into our products to be listed on our site. So the way we do this is go to our product templates. Let's select a product. Let's go for this nice pink unisex hoodie. Select it and then press add to store. So what we have now is we've selected a couple of colors. We've got a blue, a pink, and a black. We've selected some sizes, and let's press proceed to mockups. Now we have a choice of imagery. We can choose some flat mockups to show. We can have some lifestyle shots, whichever you think is best gonna suit your store. You can choose, we're just gonna go for the flat mockup. You can choose whatever color you'd like. We're gonna go for light pink, and then press proceed to details. Rename the product titles, whatever you want. Again, Printful fills in the description for you and the size guide, any tags, let's put hoodie and let's put swag. It's gonna be the name of our collection. Product collections, you can put as the homepage also and then press proceed to pricing. On the next screen, you get some details about how much you wanna increase your price by. If you wanna keep it at cost price, you can, but let's say we're gonna increase this by 10%. You can see if you change this, it updates the prices for you, so you don't really have to do anything. Once you've done that, press submit to score. It's also worth saying you can actually increase by a fixed amount. So if you wanted to add, say, five pounds onto every order, you can do that. You can see it's marked up. But let's say, yeah, let's set it as five pounds. Then submit to store. Now you can see that it's actually adding the new product from Printful into Shopify. So now if you go to products, within Shopify, we can see that we have the MakePad unisex hoodie inside of our MakePad shop. 
And to see what that looks like, open it up. You can see the description, the title. It's available in your online store. On the right hand side, it's added to swag and hoodie with tags. It's the Makerpad shop as the vendor and the product type we can add in here. And you can see it's added the imagery for the colors that we wanted to set as well inside of the variant. So nice and simple there. When you're happy with it, press save. And once it's saved, go ahead and preview this. This will show you how it's showing up in your store. Nice. So as it stands now, this is good enough to start selling. When you change the colors to pink, you can go ahead and actually order this and then Printful will fulfill it for you. So let's just take a pause. I'm going to go ahead and add the rest of the products to the shop so you can see what it looks like in the final version. Okay, once you picked a plan, added your card, press start plan. Now head back over to the online store, press disable password again, uncheck the box, give your page title, and then press save. Now your store is live. Press view store, and here we go. We have makepad-shop-myshopify.com. You can, of course, add a custom domain. But now what happens is when you order a hoodie and check out, this order will go directly to Printful and Printful will supply your order to the customer without you having to do anything. Of course, you can do some nice integrations with this and send everything through to Airtable via Zapier or notify you team in Slack. But this is how to run a completely automated swag store. Hope you enjoyed this simple tutorial and look forward to seeing what you set up and also some of the swag you start selling. See you on the next one.